This is Algebra 2 Lesson 41 on page 184. Units and unit multipliers. Okay, guys. If I want to go from 12 feet squared to inches squared, I begin with 12 feet squared. When I have a unit multiplier, in order to cancel out feet, feet now must be in the denominator. But how many feet have to be in the denominator to cancel out a feet squared? Two. Two. You need two unit multipliers. You need two unit multipliers. You need two over 12 inches. Right. So one foot is 12 inches. Okay. Look at this, guys. You don't have to multiply all this out. Well, you could actually do for this one, 12 cubed inches squared. Or you could just do 12 times 12 times 12 inches squared. All right? <clears throat> All right, so we know how to get to feet to inches. How do we get... From yards to inches. We have to multiply by feet because there's three feet in the yard. All right, so I need two yeah. yards nope, one to yard. feet. One yard. Oh, sorry, it's sorry. Squared. You're saying. Right? Multiply by three feet over one yard. Then I, I, first I'm just going to write what I need, inches. and then I know the conversions, right? Inches. So feet are in the numerator twice. So now I need to get rid of those. That's right. So I need feet in the denominator twice, and I'm going to put inches in the numerator. That's a lot of inches. All right. So how many? What's the uh, unit conversion for feet and yards? Three. Three. Three to one. Three to one. And this is. Twelve to one. Twelve to Twelve one. Twelve to one. We actually could have said there's thirty-six inches in a yard. You could have there's 36 inches in a yard. Right? You could have done that. Isn't that the same thing? Yes. It is exactly the same thing. Alright. How do I get from feet to miles? Oh, there's this. There's 5,280 feet mile. Damn. 5,280 feet in one mile. You need to memorize that. Do you have that memorized? Uh, we clearly do. You do. 5,280 <laughs> feet in one <laughs> mile. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let us walk through the example. So I'm on page, top of page 185. Use unit multipliers to change 600 inches into feet. <clears throat> so at 600 inches, I need feet in the numerator, inches in the denominator. <clears throat> 1 over 12. What's 600 divided by 12? 6. <laughs> What's 600 divided by 12? Somebody did that in the calculator. 50. 50. I said it first. 50 feet. Okay, y'all, that's, that's kind of easy, right? It's kind of easy. Y'all, that's, yeah, that's easy. elementary, literally. Yes. Okay, look at example two. Use unit multipliers to convert 44 square feet two inches squared, all right? So I begin with 44 feet squared. How many multipliers do I need? Two. Two, because I need feet in the denominator twice. So I need inches in the numerator twice. And we know there are 12 inches in a foot. 44. So it's 44 times 12 times 12 inches squared. It's like 6,000. You don't have to multiply them out. 
So like on a test, we don't have four? On a test, this is sufficient. It's not insufficient. It's sufficient, so that we get messy. All right, because they're gonna get bigger. We're gonna have more numbers, numerator, denominator. All right, look at example three. We want to convert 42 square yards. Now we're going from 42 square yards to inches squared. All right, if I begin with 42 yards squared, what are my, what's my un, unit multiplier gonna be? 36. 36 inches to one yeah. yard, but I need two of them, right? So my yards cancel out. So I end up with 42 times 36, times 36 inches squared. Got it? So far? Okay, look at example, the last one. 41.4. Now, we're gonna, multi we're gonna um, use unit multipliers to convert 16 cubic miles. How is that different? Yep. It's just three. It's cubed. Cubic miles. So now I need three unit multipliers. But I want to go to inches cubed. So what do I have to go to first? Feet. All right, so I start out with 16 miles cubed. <clears throat> okay, guys, if I look. I need three unit multipliers, right? You have to write it three times. You don't have to write it three times. But I want miles in the denominator, feet in the numerator, right? Then I need another unit multiplier cubed and it's inches to feet, really feet to inches. All right, so 5,280 feet in a mile and that multiplier is cubed, 12 feet and an inch, and that unit multiplier is cubed. So we end up with 16 times 5280 50, 50, cubed times, times 12 cubed inches cubed. What's the only term that's not cubed? Why is it not cubed? because it's already cubed. It's already cubed. What's in here is not squared or cubed. Your first term is already in cubic form. Okay? Don't cube the first, the, the, what you're converting. Only cube or square your multipliers. Got it? All right.